morning y'all <clears throat> early in uh, the gospel of Mark uh, is telling about Jesus his ministry and <clears throat> he's healing people and uh, he happens to be hanging out with tax collectors and sinners and uh, the religious criticize him I, I don't know if it says that he perceived that they heard them or if they would talk amongst themselves and said things like you know he he eats and drinks with with sinners and um, Jesus tells them that it's not the healthy he's come for um, but the sick it's not to the righteous he's been called but but the sinners and <clears throat> you know I, I've been pondering these concepts this morning and thinking about how you know for me it was when I was the most broken that I saw God the most clearly in my life and um, and I you know I, I believe it's the Lord who keeps my heart sensitive and continually broken to continually see him and I've gone through seasons where I would much rather you know uh, go to the, the the rich and the wealthy and the the whole, you know. But uh, that was not who Jesus was called to, and uh, that's not whom I'm called to. I mean, it'd really be nice to do some missions work in Hawaii or or something like that. Like, I think that's like the dream call, right? Like to marry both worlds of pleasure with um, of a life in God. But the thing, and this analogy may fall short, I, I'm not a gambler necessarily, but um, the way I perceive this situation is like, you know, it's like we won the jackpot in the casino. And so we have all these casino coins and, uh, and, and money, say a billion dollars. And then we take these billion dollars of coins that are for God's kingdom and we want to spend them out in the world. We want to, um, you know, gain momentum and clout uh, and success in this world. And it's incompatible. The, 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 the type of currency is incompatible. I, I don't know about you, but I've known at least a handful of people whom, you know, found God, God put their lives back together, healed them, and then they decided that they wanted to, you know, kind of go and explore their their own success away from God's kingdom, away from the broken. And sooner or later, they've either by choice or by um, God's choice, they found themselves among the broken. And and you know, some of those people it's to prisons. Some of those people it's to. The homeless that he the Lord allows uh, broken situations if people don't want to stay broken before him and be useful to him he'll allow situations to come that will break their situations and allow them to return to a broken state and he does that because he loves us he does that because he knows the the amount of wealth that he's put inside of us the uh, currency that he's uh, invested in us that is for the broken and and I'll say firsthand that I don't ever feel at home among the healthy and among the competent and among the intelligent uh, not to say that I don't feel God's compassion and don't you know get along with folks comparatively speaking among those who have broken hearts among those who have broken situations I feel the most useful I feel the most um, valued uh, I feel like I'm able to bring significant change because I guess that's just really, really the Lord continually working through me working with me and so I don't know where you are today um, I do pray your your heart is contrite and and open to the Lord and uh, I pray that you would find your satisfaction in uh, the wealth that the Lord has put in you the currency of the kingdom that He's wanting to spend that he's invested in you. Um, have a great day.